Hi there, I'm gonna demonstrate how to color the clothespins on the clothespin wreaths that I utilize. Um, this is what they look like colored, painted in particular for the wire rooster wreath. And all I utilize is acrylic paint, red in this instance, brown for kind of the wood stain, and you pick a color depending on what type of clothespin wreath you're doing. Uh, for the rooster wreath, uh, whose tutorial will be next, red and brown is what I use. Actually, this is flamenco red, kind of a brick red. But I just add um, my clothespins to a little bucket. I got this from Dollar Tree. The wreaths that I utilize... Um, the wreath form that I utilize, the 12-inch wreath form, takes about 54 clothespins. And these bags of 36 are a dollar at Dollar Tree, and they work just fine. So I usually do uh, three different colors. So that comes out to about 18 clothespins per shade. So I just throw a few uh, into the bucket, and... I squirt a little paint right on top of them, right inside of there, and kind of shake them around so the paint gets on the clothespins. Get them nice and coated. I add a little bit of water, which kind of turns it into red dye. Add my lid. And just shake it. The more water you put in, the lighter your color. I also do a mixture of both brown and red for more of the barn looking, uh, barn looking red. But you can mix your colors however you choose. And once you have them all mixed and colored and covered, I use a little wire rack. That's actually for a shelf, but it's vinyl coated and it helps with the drying process, I feel, because I can rinse it off. And then I just take my clothespins and clip them and let them dry. And I just repeat that process for each color. I can mix brown in uh, any colors that you choose. And that's how you dye your clothespins. Depends on what colors you use as to what color pins that you get.